Hello everyone, we're iRender. In this video, let's test the rendering speed of Unreal Engine 5.1.1 on our newly launched server RTX 4090. Our demo video today will contain 1081 frames. Let's go! The first step is transferring your project files to iRender server with the app iRender Drive. Next, log into your iRender account and create your working environment. If you are a first-time user, don't forget to follow our instructions step by step. After choosing a server with a single RTX 4090, you can boot and connect after a few minutes. Now we are on iRender Remote Machine, let's get started by downloading and installing Unreal Engine 5 with Epic Games Launcher. Please note that you just have to install everything once because your working environment will be saved after each use. Then you copy uploaded files from Z Drive to C Drive of the remote machine to work more stably. Everything is ready. Now you can open your files and set up suitable parameters and settings as you always do on your local computer. Set output on C drive and render. In this render progress, you can keep an eye on render preview or turn off your local PC if you want. The rendering still continues as long as you do not shut down the remote machine. Render completed. 1081 frames are rendered after 53 minutes. After checking your output, you can copy the result back to Z Drive and download it later with iRender Drive app on your local PC. Finally, let's together have a look at the final result. The top line of graphics cards on the market won't let you down. Thank you for watching and don't hesitate to give us a try with our latest configuration for Unreal Engine. iRender, happy rendering.